minutes to drop by Richard. No worries. Going into the Forbidden Forest for the first time. bad people here. Huh. Rebellion. Hi, Yank. Welcome to the stream. If you've got this game, I have enabled drops as well, so... Here I am, as good as my word. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. Just like a Gryffindor to brave the Forbidden Forest in pursuit of adventure. Well said. Now where do we go from here? Follow me. I shall lead you as far as I can, but I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. Keep your eyes open for a birdbath. When you find it, say intramuros. I think it's Latin. Or Greek. As you can imagine, I never paid much attention in school. Shall we? Aside from the bird bath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks. A stone bridge, a water... And, if I recall, a Lumos. lake. You'll see. You've been very helpful. Thank you. Surprising how much of this is rather unfortunately coming back to me. Um, so let's look at this. Spiders. Hmm. You know. The closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Probably best Lumos. I leave you to it. Simply stick to the path and keep a sharp eye out for that bird bath. Adieu. Is that Latin? Oh, oh wow. Hmm. These are high level. The 
just respawned. Oh dear lord, I don't like this. The waterfall for a thief, Jack was surprisingly as good as his word. Something oddly solemn about this place. Such regal creatures, stags. There it is, just as Jackdaw described. Intramuros. Eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. Oh. We'll report back to Ranrock now. Let's see where Jack Doris led me.
wonder how big this place is. This room must have something to do with opening this door. I can shoot the symbol, but it doesn't stay lit for long. Someone didn't want casual visitors down here. So well uh, with like, the design. I wonder if any of my spells will help me through this. So it was worth it, I guess.
don't like the little notification thing. It annoys me. Weird little OCD I have. Just give uh, me a sec. <coughs> I don't think there's a clear wall button, but there isn't. Aww. Puff skin. It's cute. deviating from the path. If I could summon that platform to me, I could likely get on it. Accio! It's kind of cool. An untouched chest. Jackdaw wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. Finding all types of gear down here. It's good. Revelio. Akio. That definitely looks like a door. Not a headless skeleton in sight. Mm -hmm. hmm, but I may as well help myself to this. So can I. Perhaps the next symbol is hidden somewhere. Really can't jump up there. 
Why can't they shoot them from here? I can see them. I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? Good thing Jack Daw didn't fall down there. Akio. Incendio. Akio. Touched chest. Tactor wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. Oh, come on, it's ridiculous. Not a headless skeleton in sight. Hmm, but I may as well help myself to this. Taking any risks. Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sign of him. Revelio. So, uh, back to the beginning. Um. Akio. Incendio. 
Okay. Another high stat. Look. Ah, it's locked. Got to be level 14. Which I'm close to, I think. Very close to. Let's find out I'm up soon. And level 14 as well. But it's crap anyway. Compared to this. Defense 30. Defense. Oh, that's just that's offense. Yeah, but my offense is pretty soon. I would say. Scarf. Yeah. Still got a decent one. Sold. Let's have a look. Let's gather some more stuff. Chest. Tarotor wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. There's a lot of repeated dialogue in this mission, I have to admit. I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? Nice big open space. Enough for a big spider to pop out, bite me in the ass. Finding out that always casting that spell is helpful. Akio. That's odd. I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been more thorough. Would we have here? Offense 29. Yes, please. Um, Gonna have a decent amount of money after this, I reckon. But there's no sign of him. Revelio. Not a headless skeleton in sight. Hmm, but I may as well help myself to this. Oh, that's good for the potions now, that's making me think. Big boss battle. Big spider. Rebellion. I'm sure he's ready to go. This is just a... Uh. There uh -huh. it is. The bridge, it's almost complete. What's going to drop down the middle? Huge spider. More spiders. Yeah. He's can't drop the Let me open. Grenade. Stupid. Incendio. Akio.
incendio. Get a feeling that that was not the final cross in this area. Down there. I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left him something behind for me, but where could he be? Yeah, one there, down there. See it through here, no. I'll need to look around for the symbol. I'll do this in our time, so. That's cool. Let's go. I must be getting closer to Jack Doll's remains and those pages. I don't like the look of that. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. Thank you for keeping these pages safe all these years. Here it is. The map that brought your doom, Jackdaw. Hmm. Is there something beyond this room? I was in the middle of a battle somewhere. Oh no, 
The room's starting to flood. How am I being protected? What sort of magic is this? This is interesting. I can only hope this magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of here. What is this place? Can it be? It's you. Has someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from the pensives. You're Professor Rackham. I am indeed. I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora Morganark were when you started at Hogwarts. You've paid attention. And might I presume you share our ability? To see traces of ancient magic? Yes, sir, I do. As you have likely realized by now, our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic. We can access expressions of magic that few others can. Opportunities will arise that allow you to sharpen this rare talent. Do not squander them. I won't, Professor. Thank you. We have much to discuss. But first, a map found in a certain book led you here. Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with me, sir. Hmm. That is unfortunate. I'm afraid we must pause our conversation until you return with the book. Very well. I'll retrieve the book right away. Good. We shall speak again once the book is in place. Yay, I've unlocked talents, finally. Right. I want to be able to... Yes, that's what I want to do. That one. I have nine talent points. Just want to unlock all of them now. I'm just just gonna unlock this other page. Right, three. So this is when I can unlock a 
Bardo Kadava Mastery. Level 22. Requirement as well. I'll work on that later. Spells. Oh, that's a good one. Okay, Marjorie. Enemies near a target summit. Oh, gee, oh, that's perfect. Yeah. So now I can. So cool. Switch between things. Okay. Like that. I found the pages and the map chamber. Why would I need the book? How inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Well, this is quite a fast travel now. Back to the map chamber. There's a chest there. Oh. will be back. I did promise him I wouldn't neglect my studies while he was away. Suppose I have enough to distract myself with till he returns with the book. How did I get back here? It's got one of those frogs. Yay, flying class. Let's go flying class. Oh, stick.
Everybody grab a broom, and we shall get started. Mr. Clopton, your attention, please. Sorry, Madam Kagawa. Everyone, please welcome a new student to our flying class. Welcome. Hello. The goal of today is to remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick safely. As broom flight is, first and foremost, a means of transportation. This, I fear, some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, and loop-the-loops will not be taught or in fact tolerated in this class. We'll leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. Hey. Not a fan, I take it? Now, let's see how well everyone kept up with their practice over the summer holidays. For those who need a refresher, step up to your broom. Say up, firmly and clearly. Then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Up! Thank you. Now, your turn. Up! Up! Up, you stupid ratty school broom! Up! One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. And if you hear my whistle while you're in flight, ground yourself at once. Good. Now. For your first lesson, fly through each ring in the courtyard. <laughs> Do take care. This is brilliant. The brooms are school This property. will take some getting used to. I want to. them returned in one piece. Well done. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise, shall we? This next set of rings will take you around the grounds for more of a challenge. What a view! <laughs> Hello! Nice day for a flight! Made it! Oh, did anyone else see that? Oh, the old boathouse. Wish you could have experienced crossing the lake as the first year. I watched you fly through those rings. You seem to handle yourself on that dusty school broom well enough. I'd imagine you're ready for something a bit more challenging. But I'm getting ahead of myself. We haven't properly met. I'm Everett Clopton. Am I right in suspecting that a Gryffindor like you might be interested in a high-flying adventure? <sighs> Can't say no to that. What did you have in mind? A bit of a detour, so to speak. Follow me. The tour is about to begin. Follow closely now. Right now, we're flying over the Transfiguration Courtyard. <laughs> Lovely as ever. Let's hope the Headmaster isn't having tea by the window today. Nice to get above it all, isn't it? Ahead of the garden. The Hufflepuff common room windows just peek out. Bit claustrophobic for my taste. How is Everett flying so quickly? 
Here's something handy to know. Lean forward for a burst of speed. Helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. <laughs> now that's more like it. You sure you're not part Hippogriff? There's the famous bridge. Think of all the magic holding it up. I mean, look at it. And Meowlery. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? Flying tips and a jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite the tall Everett. That's Kagawa's whistle. This concludes our tour. Best hurry back. Dismount here. And where have you two been? Oh, hello, Professor. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty points will be taken from each of you for not following my instructions. Mr. Clopton, I am disappointed in you. You're in this class because you're I... still because you're still not showing yourself, or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But, Professor... Enough! Class is finished for the day. As for you, you do well to use better judgment in the future. Chin up. That was some rather good flying. Right. Sorry about that business with Kagawa. It was worth losing a few house points for that detour. You seem at home on a broom. Bet if you had a fancy model, you could fly laps around Imelda. She's Kagawa's favorite. I could show her a thing or two if I had my own broom. <sighs> Hate having to return the school broom after class. Perhaps I have to purchase a broom then. If you can, you should. Wish I could. I recommend visiting Albie Weeks at Spintwitch's in Hogsmeade. He's always looking to test new models. I'll keep an eye out for you in the sky. I have uncollected rewards in... That's the room of requirement interest.
let's head to Outpost. Meet, here I come. No need. Ah, new face. Rebellion. Hello, Mr. Weeks, is it? Albie Weeks at your service. Welcome to Spin Witches. Apologies if you came by before and weren't able to come in. Shop's been closed since trade routes were disrupted. I had to travel as far as London to meet with my supplier. And I've only just returned, thankfully, with inventory. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Got a few Hell rare yeah. weavers available. Ember dash, silver arrows, wind wisps too. No matter what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. Sounds quite the array of brooms. I'll have a look around. Thank you. First of all, let's before we buy. What are we looking for today? Sell everything that I've just picked up. No need. Nice doing business with you. I don't want to sell that yet because I don't know what it is. Do you want to sell this though? That item is of the highest quality. I buy different types of rooms. This is cool. That item is of the highest quality. It's got to be. It's got to be this one. You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you. Broom, broom. Thanks for stopping by. Whilst nearly any broom will certainly be a step up from the practice brooms in Kagawa's class, they all have their limitations. You seem to be a flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancements? Go on. Ha! Knew I was right about you. I think you'll be quite happy with the performance of any broom at lower altitudes. But you may notice that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise. I believe I can remedy this issue. I have some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, if you will, that will improve the performance of any broom you fly. What I need is someone to conduct a broom flight and report back to me so I can perfect the upgrades. As it happens, another Hogwarts student, Imelda Reyes, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. If you were to compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved, I could complete work on my first upgrade. What say? That sounds intriguing. I'll see what I can do. Thank so you. It'll be worth your while. Out, if I'm not, around the, world, the new upgrade ought to enhance brooms in every regard. And I can give you a special price. The time trial should be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Reyes will sort you out. Once you've beaten Imelda's time, be sure to let me Rebellion. know. Rebellion. Ah, I can't help but admire Mr. Weeks' enthusiasm. Right, so how do I equip the room then? See it there, we're in a no fly zone, so sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Aha. Finally, I 
can now fly. There's a station. Revelio. No, I swear I won't be wasting your time, and I'm grateful for the opportunity ever so. Come on, then. What you got? It's Why a... is it moving? <sniffs> what? I bet... Your bag. It's wriggling. What you got in there? Not rat oh, No, it's a niffler. It's what a niffler. A niffler? He's sharp. Stole from me, he did. He's robbed by a niffler. Give me. I, that's what I'm saying. He, he's a natural. Worth his weight in galleons. Go on, then. Show him to me. Uh, uh, I must You're wasting my time. Ow! No, I would you never waste me, your... You little rat scratch me. On, you little... you can't even keep oh, hold on, of a rat. where are you? If I he's ever catch a rat. rat, it's dead. You hear me? Dead! Uh, Get out of he's here! He's not a rat. Amateur. I want the niffler. Give me the niffler. Hey, hey, I'll find your niffler. <laughs> Rebellion. Oh, I want a Niffler. Hello. Do you have anything for sale? That I do, but, uh, what? Just exploring the countryside a bit. Aye. <laughs> bit of a wanderer, man. Name's Leopold Babcock, and I wouldn't dare set foot in a place like the Forbidden Forest without a steady supply. What do you say, my young friend? A... Something to consider. Aye, let me know. What do you have for sale? See if there's something you need. Oh, I'll definitely buy some of those. Thank you for your patronage. Cool. That's been a pleasure. Merlin trial when I see one. Rebellion. Rebellion. Incendio. Incendio. 
Incendium. Incendio. Revelio Accio Oi, can you help me?
remove requirement. Professor Weasley? Hmm. Somewhere away from prying eyes. stopped me and I... Merlin's beard. I see you've wasted oh. no time. Well done. Shall we? After you, Professor. What is this place? This is the Womb of Requirement. It only appears when one is in real need of it. Ordinarily, a student might stumble upon this room entirely by accident. If ever. I'd only planned to suggest to you how to find it by walking past that bit of wall, focusing on what you need. But you've managed to reveal the room on your own. While I'm here, we should take advantage of the moment. Now. Where is Deke? Hmm. He must have sneaked past and gone ahead. Deke, Professor? The house elf I was speaking to in my classroom your first day. Thought he might help you use the room once you've found it. <sighs> There's no chance I'm clambering over this mess. Hmm. This presents the perfect opportunity to teach you Evanesco, the vanishing spell. You can cast Evanesco to vanish certain objects, such as these chairs and other things here in the room. I suggest you practice the wand movements first, then you can clear the chairs away. Oh, that's a tricky one. Splendid. Now, cast Evanesco on those chairs. Evanesco. Where is it? There. Let's put this on. Altering spell. Conjuring spell. Let's put these on a villain page as well. So. Excellent work. You'll note that you are now in possession of Moonstone. We shall discuss its uses later. Let's move on. I think we've got lots of moonstone, so that's good. Where in Merlin's name is that elf? Is that... Goodness! My old school bag! I wondered where that had got to. I can't believe it's still here. I'll just take a quick look at this. Give you an opportunity to explore on your own until we locate Deke. Yes, Professor. <gasps> Dear me. Can't you keep it down? Some of us are trying to rest. Check that out. 
Oh, it's decent. Definitely suits me. Might keep that one. Hope this isn't as precarious as it looks. It is. An intruder! Stop them! No, not that's not helpful, you worthless pile of tin. The lighting is just fantastic. <laughs> Is that the vanishing? That's the vanishing cabinet. In the Harry Potter things. Oh wow. That's cool. That is very cool. But there must be a way to get over there then. Rebellion. Yeah, there's there's a lot of chests over there. I need to go over there. Wait, I just miss a chest? And I missed a bag. Uh, can I just... Let me can I climb up here? <laughs> Rebellion. Excuse me. How do I get the bag? Repairer. Lumos. So it's done. Self managed to get around in here. What was that? It's a snitch. Was that a golden snitch? Perhaps you should summon your wits and find out. <laughs> Self can find us in here. Wait a minute, how do I get that done? Look at that. Yeah. Rebellion.
Let me use Akio. I have glitched that out. Oh no, I haven't. Levioso! Akio! Money, money. DPJ. How you doing, bud? Come to you. Hello. Ah, oh, Deke, we've been looking for you. Uh, apologies, Professor Weasley. Deke was looking through some of what's appeared in the room since Deke was last here. Is this the student? Indeed, it is. Deke is honored to meet you. Deke has been a friend since I was a second year. We discovered this room together. I mentioned you to Deke. We believe that you might be able to benefit from this room like I did. Deke, would you be so kind? Of course, Professor Weasley. 
The Room of Requirement will always be equipped for the Seeker's needs. It's unplottable, so won't appear on any map. Most happen upon it by accident, if ever. Deep-seen students in need of an extra file for potions stumble upon the room filled with them. You seem to have accessed it in its form as the Room of Hidden Things. I was thinking about needing a place away from prying eyes. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, that explains it then. What I need specifically is a place where I can catch up on my schoolwork without distraction. Well then, the room can provide you with precisely that. Now, it's time to focus on what you need. Just close your eyes, imagine the room precisely as you need it. The room will do the rest. to work with. I look forward to seeing what you do with the space. Ah, and it seems the room has provided you with a desk of description. Excellent. It can identify unfamiliar items of clothing. One should always understand the effects of anything in which one is clothed. You'll find plenty of items of clothing that need to be identified. The desk will be an invaluable resource. I imagine the desk of description will come in handy. It will. I hope you'll take advantage of it. Now, I'll give you a brief lesson in conjuring. The room might not provide everything you need on its own. Conjuring? Yes, the magic of creating or conjuring objects. I'll teach you. Very good. When conjuring more complex objects, you'll need what's called a spellcraft. Spellcrafts are like recipes. They list the ingredients or resources needed to conjure a particular object. You should have acquired some for a potion station and potting table from tomes and scrolls in Hogsmeade. I did. Where can I find the resources I need? While resources such as Moonstone can be obtained throughout the Highlands, it's much safer and easier to purchase them. They can also be collected by <laughs> vanishing objects route. in yeah, the right. room, such as the chairs you vanished earlier. In fact, you should have enough resources for now. I see. Can I regain resources by vanishing something I've already conjured? You can indeed. Hmm, quite perceptive. Why don't you give it a try? Go ahead and conjure the potion station and potting table. You should find both familiar since they'll resemble the ones you've already used to study magical plants and brew potions in class. Right. Now it just becomes like The Sims. Let's put... Yeah. Oh, I've got a lot of things I can conjure. Oh, look at this. I can just get all of them, I guess. I need more space.
I have reached my budget for this item. What, so I can only... Potions, stations, budget, complete more quests. Oh, okay. Oh, are they just different styles? Oh, I see. Um, okay. Let's put this over here somewhere then. Which one do you want? Well you can use these whenever you need to brew potions or grow plants. Presuming, of course, you've collected any seeds or potion ingredients you need in Hogsmeade or outside the castle grounds. Got that already. What about this? as well. Be spending a while in here. Deke will be here to answer any questions you may have. Do not underestimate his insights. I will be sure to speak with Deke if I need anything. Thank you. Good luck. I shall linger a bit longer in case you'd like to learn another transfiguration spell for use in the room. tables. Nice, nice. Got lights. I'd more to teach you about transfiguration. Chairs. More pictures unlocked. And what's this? A long mirror. And 
look, there's seasonal decorations. Jack-o'-lanterns, Christmas tree. Interesting. Okay, teach me more. I'm ready for the next lesson, Professor. Very well. You can acquire it by vanish. Return to me once... I have the moonstone you requested, Professor. Good. Then we may begin your lesson. You can conjure more than potions and herbology tables. Conjuration can be used to decorate this space to your liking. Why don't you try it on the walls and floor? I've just done all of this, but okay. Conjured everything I can. What's next, Professor? I think you're ready to take on alteration. The altering spell will allow you to customize any conjured item. That's you can change the colors, patterns, and styles of your furniture to suit your taste. Let's get started, shall we? Watch closely as I demonstrate how to perform the altering spell. Just aim your wand at any conjured item and perform the altering spell to customize it. done. Now you're ready for something a little more advanced. You can use the altering spell directly on the room's architecture. Try these new designs on the floor or balcony. Your space might benefit from a bit of ambiance, don't you think? Deke, would you mind? Of course, Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley showed Deke this bit of magic some years ago. Deke thinks you'll enjoy it. 
Uh, come and talk to Deke when you're ready. Professor Weasley said I should ask you about changing the room's ambience? Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? I'd like the room to feel mysterious and eerie, as if I'm in the Forbidden Forest, surrounded by shadows. Oh, sounds perfect. Oh, that's cool. Can I just change? I want to. I want to see all of them. Hmm, quite a difference. Of course, you needn't keep this style if you don't like it. You can always ask Deke to change it back. Now you have learned a good bit about alteration. Thank you, Professor. The room is full of possibilities. Indeed. No matter how much time I spend here, the room always manages... itself to your needs. It must have sensed that you needed more space to practice spell casting. If you'd like to customize the space further, you can use these spell crafts. You'll find more of them both inside and outside the school. Thank you, Professor. I shall keep an eye out. Good. I'll leave you to it. This is your space now. Use it wisely. How do I make this space bigger though? And I want to be able to do the thing. Change this. Can we have a bit more change this? I'd like to ask you about. Of course! Let's try natural and earthy. Oh, sounds perfect. Oh, that's better. More light. Perfect. Don't really need this time.
Omega. Go. Change the color as well. Oh my gosh.
Okay, so it does tell you what kind of missions you have to do to unlock stuff, so that's cool. Fetch some toms and scrolls. Okay, so that's cool. What the hell would you do? Toms and scrolls as well, okay. Might have to go pay them a visit. Okay, the room requirement is awesome. <laughs> See this becoming very useful later on. Oh, you professor, but some plants here seem to be ready to harvest. Oh, they just keep they just keep going. Nice. So what if Can I not just plant another one? Oh. oh, I can. I totally can. Oh, man. Okay, we're gonna have to go to Thompson Scrolls because we're gonna have to get bigger things. How do I unlock more rooms as well? I haven't even got the garden yet. So I can have my little beast, little beast pets. Okay, Niffler! Niffler. Right, how do I get Niffler? <laughs> uh, TPJ, are you still there? Just with me in the background. How do I get the um, greenhouse add on for my requirement? Let's start getting into. What was I learning? I've done all those. Just start getting to the dark arts. First time you take damage. Increase damage. That's gonna be useful. How many put to stealth? Enemies ability detect is reduced, could be useful, allows you to sprint while losing. That's very useful. Nice. 
Okay. So, okay, we might as well do this. Uh, I'll post what we've got. Oh, I've done all this. Just haven't read them. I'm just gonna keep going, Dave, until I've uh, until I get it. There's a ton of things to do anyway. Nine places. Okay. Exploration. What's this? Claim awards. Inventory expansion reward. Ooh. Thank you. Got a stupid costume. I think people really need to know about these things because I had no idea that you could get rewards from this screen. Now I've just got like, a ton of things, which is awesome. flying mounts even though I've got one unlocked with the deluxe edition anyway <sighs> ah, let's go get this other spell require and use a focus potion Need to go to J. Pippin's potions. It's probably in Hogsmeade. J. Pippin's, J. Pippin's. Actually, while I'm here, I might as well go to Tom's and Scrolls as well. But let's go to the potions first. I'm still learning where everything is. Ollivanders. Broomsticks, follow the butterflies, what's that? Conjuration spellcraft. Huh. 
Oh, another side quest to do. Not that that's a bad thing. Ah, there it is. Right, let's try over there. At least the fast travel is super fast compared to other games like Cyberpunk and stuff that just took forever. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Come on in. Healing potions are a speciality here, should you need any. Rebellion. Something underground. Oh, much better. What can I do for you today? Right, let's settle this crap first. Very good. Never hurts to keep my stocks replenished. Focus potion recipe. That's what we want. A wise decision. Thank you. Recipe for a dam powerful damage potion. Invisible. Potion increases drinking spell damage for an limited amount of time. Powerful damage potion. Creates a storm around the drinker which will stun and damage nearby enemies. That must be the damage potion that that's talking about. Thunderbrew, yes. Interesting. A wise decision. Thank you. Let's not get it yet. Oh, I kind of want to get it now, but we've got lots of time. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Right, acquire and use a focus potion. Acquire maxima and endless potion and use them simultaneously. Maxima and oh, okay. What can I do for you today? A wise decision. Thank you. Do I, I hope to see you again. Them? Farewell for now. That's that's pretty cool. Uh, attend potions last during the day. Okay. Can I do this side quest we're talking about? She mentioned something in Let's go there first while we're here. Crit side quests, get conjuration. Is it in here? Would I have the courage to go into the forest? Rebellion. Pardon me, but were you saying something? Oh, hello. Talking to... I was mused when I was told horrible. It's... I do, yes. But very well. If I have time, I shall see where they lead. Oh, how come... You can usually... Follow the butterflies. 
Don't forget, the butterflies always seem to be on the food. Alright, let's go and help her. That's because you know the moon. Hogs meet, here I come. This place has seen better days. Wait. Isn't that... part of that map I found earlier? Where is it? This. No, it's not. Okay. I think I know where that is, actually. That must be... where the entrance... Yeah, here. So it is this. Is it some sort of puzzle? So, I have found... So I found this thing. I don't know where I found this to be honest. I'm just sorting my inventory now. And it's brought me to... <coughs> like here. Because I kind of recognised it. So I'm assuming it's got something to do with... Ah, oh, you've done it already. Of course you've done it already. Jesus. Why do I bother asking you? Lumos. Do you have to come here at night? Lumos. Enchanted candles. Oh, cool. Wonder where they're heading. Oh, that's very cool. What a cool little puzzle thing. I don't like the fact that they're luring me into the Forbidden Forest, but I'll, I'll go with it. The candles seem to be leading into the Forbidden Forest. Oh no shit, Sherlock. <laughs> there they are. She wasn't making it up. Oh yeah, the butterflies. I need well, to do something with those. Miss Willis, we might get an answer about these butterflies. Lumos. I want to follow these candles first, even though I'm supposed to be doing these butterflies in.
The treasure must be nearby. I suppose a picnic with a bit of treasure hunting suits me. Oh, that's cool. That's a treasure hunt. Anyway, where's this butterflies? There they are. Where are you going, butterflies? Well, Boom. well. Look what we have here. It's always nice when you manage to do like two quests at once. Un unintentionally. Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh wait, I can just... Abandoned long ago, no doubt. Oh, that's cool. It's got like a bubble around it. <laughs> that's one way to do it, I guess. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Return to Miss Willis Drewley. Oh, please tell me you have an answer for me about the butterflies. Hello, Miss Willardsy. Well, what happened? Did you find them? They led me into the forest and revealed the treasure. Oh, how lovely! I'm glad you were rewarded for your efforts. Oh, perhaps one day I'll be able to bring myself to go into the forest. For now, I'm happy simply knowing there's something so lovely to see, should I dare. She's the kind of girl you don't want to work in a pub with. Or anyone like that. I don't know. <laughs> we need to do keep a ten purchase slots during the day. Okay, so I need to make it day. Let's quickly make it day. Ten potions to ask quickly. Hasn't been anyone as bad as the Anyone still Does watching? I am. Twitch drops won't be turned off. Let's so just get people in here to uh, enjoy the stream. Rebellion. Okay, before I go to class, I really want to go and see all the owls. Can I land on top of it or is it going to be like, oh you can't land here? Oh, no, you can. Yeah. Oh. Oh, no, go up. 
sort of thing. Let me also. <laughs> Rebellion. This full damage a thing, that is a good question. Only one way to find out. It is. Definitely a thing. That's the first time I died. Your journey has ended. Ominous. Hear about that, too, sir. The outer is cool. It's really nice. Nice little touch. Oh, on that view. Look at that view of the Quidditch pitch right there, boy. Look at that, lads. Uh, no, yeah, I've got a mic. Hey, Drunken Panda, how's it doing? Fly, buddy, fly. Yeah, I can do that. Oh, apparently I can't fly here. Almost jumped off the fucking cliff, but I can't fly. Hang on, hang on. Now I can. Uh, I definitely do have a mic. I hope it. I hope it's working. And I haven't been talking to myself this whole time. Okay, yeah, it is working. Don't scare me like that. Oh, I really do hope they uh, bring Quidditch into this. It'd be amazing. Hey, you, Gryffindor. DPJ, you just scared me with your latest video. I had to watch like a few minutes of it just to like. <laughs> oh, God, who who was it that spoiled it for you? I, I think I saw it pop up on my feed at one point. Was it my death?
Oh, I'll, I'll watch it in a bit. I just, <laughs> I just had to watch a little bit of it just to kind of make sure you uh, hadn't found some game-breaking shit that would ruin the game for me. Ah, uh, where am I going? This way. I think there were doxy eggs as well. Potions class. I've been streaming for two and a half hours. Jesus, didn't even realise. Not bad, not bad. Take your time. I completed your assignments, Professor. Good. You should be ready to learn to pulso. Let's see what you can do. Uh, yeah, you can join my party. Uh, you, you choose to opt in to join in the audio. So, send me a... ping me an invite. You've got it now. If you'd like to practice, and I think you should, Perhaps best not to go flinging your classmates about the halls. I suggest having a go at the enchanted books here. That you seem staunchly determined to master your spell casting. You won't, you won't come through my stream at all. I promise. It, it, it gives you like the personal option. Like, do you want to include your stream? And you have to actually go into like uh, the party and click on a button to do it. So. Rebellion. Sup, bud? Why, All right. How are you doing? Good. Are you, have you just like been up since like dawn? <laughs> Brilliant. Game is fucking awesome, man. No. I just keep getting distracted. Are you actually doing the? Did you get a Niffler yet? Right, okay. Go go to Hogsmeade Station. Some guy is trying to sell his Niffler to someone and it jumps out of his bag. You might be able to catch it there. Yeah. yeah. The the yeah, the thing that um scoops up all the gold. The, there's a <laughs> Yeah, there's a there's a guy with a top hat. I was streaming it earlier, I was trying to catch the Niffler, but I don't think I had the right... I don't have the bag yet, so... He's trying to sell it to someone, and it jumps out of his bag. And he's, he's just, like, standing there trying to find it. Um, oh, what am I doing now? You know, I keep keep getting distracted. Like I'm doing the main quest, and then I'm like, "Oh, what's that over there?" <laughs> For a game that's never done an open world, 
RPG before. They fucking smashed it right out of the ballpark. Spare a moment? I could use your help. <laughs> I was gonna you know I said I was gonna start doing videos on this, but I just I just wanna enjoy the game man. <laughs> I just can't be bothered. <laughs> It's not my living, so it's it's better that I just link people to you and your channel now. Just better. <laughs> Sebastian, it's been a while. It has. Glad you received my owl. Mm-hmm. I have something to show you. And it First, will. let me thank you for what you did in the library. Of course. Scribner tried to give me detention, but I have ways out of these things. Well, you took the fall for me. And that counts for something. Did you find what you were looking for? I did, but something was missing. I'm not sure here is the best place to discuss it. Understood. We can talk more in a moment, in the Undercroft. Not even the professors know about this place. This oh way. yeah, by the way, quick thing about your YouTube. I've been learning about these things. Apparently it's There's better to put like titles to your video here. before... It's well disguised. Like, put Hogwarts Legacy after. It, if that makes sense. Might some kind soul help me? Yeah, so if someone's searching for, um, you know, spell books in Hogwarts Legacy, spell books would be the first thing that pops up. Oh, really? And then they fucking change the algorithm. <laughs> no, I've been looking. You're, you're getting uh, some some serious views. But like you said, people are playing it, and then they're going to get stuck. And then, hey, look, DPJ's got one of those guides. <laughs> How did you find this place? My friend, Ominous Gaunt. He named it the Undercroft. We used to play gobstones here all the time. With my sister. Oh, and can you? She loved that infernal game. What I wouldn't give to lose to her again. Ooh. I should tell you, I swore to Ominous I would safeguard this place. So please, keep this between us. He never confides in anyone. Yeah. But he's trusted me since the day we met. I wouldn't want to jeopardize that. We used to sneak in here almost daily. We've never been caught. I think I've seen Ominous in potions. Or was it Herbology? Mm. I've noticed that he uses his wand to navigate the castle. He does. No idea how, though. Ominous was born blind, and no spell can reverse it. His wand seems almost <laughs> sentient. You're welcome, mate. Not surprising, I suppose. Ollivander always says, the wand chooses the wizard. Is that how he found this place? Uh, you've got no, to go someone to the in his family knew about um, it. The that link I put full on the Discord. Of secrets. I've never heard anyone else speak of it. And I've certainly never seen anyone else here. Again, mention this to no one. No, no, no. It's just the, um, he has no love lost for his family on, or their secrets. You go on your Discord. But this I'll place is special to him. Understood. Why does Ominous yeah, have no love it, loss for a load of people his have asked me the same thing. Family, direct it's just in general under Pins. Uh, you have to One go to the, the Hogwarts Legacy Twitch Drops Obsessed website. Obsessed with blood status, most of them. And you click claim now Ominous on there, and then it will appear in game. As he'll be the first to tell you. It's, anyway, it's not as simple as claiming it on Twitch or logging into the game and it's just there. Sneak off to. Annoyingly. Away from prying eyes. And even practice otherwise forbidden spells. Really? Like what? Like the Blasting Curse. Professors say it's not an appropriate spell to teach Catch students. <laughs> a proper magical education ought to include all magic. My thoughts exactly. A spell like Confringo is only truly dangerous in untrained hands. Such spells should be properly taught, not banned. To be fair, I'm admittedly partial to more fiery forms of magic. Yeah. I've, but I, you should learn it. I bet you haven't even got down there I can yet. teach it to you <laughs> safely here. <laughs> It may take a while to get the feel for it. 
Mimic by one. I think movement. there's um. The incantation is I think there's a certain part of the map. Very well. I don't know where it is that you can only access through going through caves or something. I heard someone say this in a TikTok earlier. Got what, sir? Oh. You're getting it. Ready to actually Don't catch try him. it out? <laughs> keep one as a pet, though. Stick to targets, though. <laughs> Best to keep the undercroft intact. Have a go at those candelabras. Both I don't know if you're uses, fucking with me or if that's a thing. Because if that's a thing, you can make some serious money. <laughs> Just get them all fucking. Like <laughs> that's me. Wait, what the fuck did I... I wasn't even concentrating on the game. What, was I, what have I just learned? A long range bolt that does that. I think it must be that one. Yeah, it is. Okay, it's pretty. Yeah. Nice work. Sweet. How's it feel? That's it. I think I've got it. Oh, well, I could have done. done with this earlier. I did a puzzle where I I was running like between three different it was one of those uh, Merlin's Merlin puzzles. And I was running between three different things using Incendio and I've just unlocked uh Confringo. I have to say, I enjoyed that. The first time Ominous and I practiced Confringo, we singed our Confringo. eyebrows. <laughs> I would have paid to see that. I swore we'd never have you got any, down. Have you got the Avada Kedavra yet? There's something about that spell that's addictive. Have you got Avada Kedavra yet? Or? The blast sure does heat things up. What? <laughs> I see how? how you lost your eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> You'll get used to it. And Ominous and I used to practice down here for hours. The Undercroft was our retreat. I haven't been here in some time. It's not the same without Anne. I'm sorry about oh, your wow. sister. If there's anything I can do, perhaps when I next head to Feldcroft, you could well, come you along. Look all of the spells Me before you can get them. She could use some cheering up. Just let me know when, and I'll meet you. Oh, she misses Hogwarts. The spells She's been stuck don't at home with our guardian, in like a particular order, Uncle Solomon. I'm seeing they're kind of dotted all around the place. You'll have to meet him too. Well, meeting a new student will be precisely what she needs. I shall look forward to it. Cheers. By the way, <laughs> what was it you couldn't discuss out in the hall earlier? Uh, I'm not sure where to start. You said something was missing from what you found in the library. I assume it's to do with what you told me. About the port key and Gringotts and Ranrock. Nothing gets past cadaver. you. And yes, it is. I... As I'm sure you suspect, there is a bit more to all of this. I'm listening.
I'm back. Uh, you must promise my, to keep uh, this thing. between us. I trusted you with knowledge of the secret Undercroft. In the of a All right. I can see tr ancient ma Honestly, I'm figuring. I that's what. And this, I, well, in the me spend as and from. Well, um, they are called. Where would it be? Are we under collections? Uh, Puffskine, Puffskine, I've put this on the stream. Is that the one you mean? Puffskines. Uh, if my memory correct serves me correctly, somewhere around the Forbidden Forest, I've definitely seen. I definitely saw a little kind of circle with loads of them in it. Leave the Undercroft. Hello, Sebastian. Wait. You there! I can hear you! Oh, hello. Ominous, isn't it? I believe we have potions together. And herbology? I recognize that voice. Heard you talking to Gareth Weasley in potions class. You're the new fifth year. Did you just come from the Undercroft? How did you get in there? Uh, I wasn't concentrating. Do I say she's, Sebastian showed me the Undercroft or not? Uh. Actually, Sebastian brought me there, but he made it perfectly clear to oh, keep quiet late. about it. That rat! You breathe a word about this place to anyone, and not even your precious Professor Fig will be able to help you. My father is friends with the headmaster. And I'm not afraid to exploit that connection if I need to. I have a feeling the set he keeps the same answer anyway. You needn't threaten me. I'm not going to say anything about your undercroft. Why should I trust you? You just betrayed Sebastian. Please. I was trying to defend him. He was clear that this was a secret place and I was to tell no one. He's a good friend. I don't need you to tell me about my oldest friend. Thank you very much. Ominous, I just meant- I know what you meant. Sebastian gets himself in enough trouble. He doesn't need your help. Go on. Sebastian is going to get an earful about this. Oh, I've got that, yeah. I'll wait for that straight away. I've unlocked. I unlocked all three of those things so I can switch my spells around. I'm assuming you can do a fourth, but I haven't unlocked that yet. Because that's super useful. Although I should really, uh. Okay, where to now?
Ooh. Didn't think about that. I did try... I did try opening some chests and then changing the time of day to see if that worked. And then I also tried reloading the game as well, but... Because I'm, I'm sure I've looted the same chest twice in this, Off but another adventure, it might be, it? yeah, it might be on a timer. It didn't give a lot, like 50, but still, every penny counts, eh? I was hoping. I mean, to be fair, I'm not doing too bad. I think I've got, um, what much have I got? I didn't see that. Is that the gear? I've got 2,000 at the moment. Two, two, three, nine. But I did just spend a crap ton. Your bat. Finally, Minister Spavin talks more than he listens. Ranted on. Oh yeah, yeah. I've got a couple of those dragons. in Hogsmeade. Wouldn't listen I haven't to a word about yet. goblins. Speaking of which, listen, Professor. So much happened while you were away. Nearly Headless Nick asked me to get some rotten roast beef from the kitchens. Rotten roast beef? Yes, I thought it was odd too. Oh, what they did But then, we took the roast beef to Sir Podmore of the Headless Hunt, and... You met the Headless Hunt? Oh, well, nice. That must have been interesting, to say yes. that. Yes. And then I had to find Richard Jackdaw's head in the pumpkins, so that he'd tell me about how he died. Can you Who not just, like... Earth is Can you not just, like, Richard float Jackdaw? them? He was a student there was long ago. Anyway, he told me about a secret cavern. I went there, and right next to Jackdaw's skeleton, I found the missing pages. You found the pages? I did. And because Jackdaw had followed the map they contained, when I found the pages, I found the location on the map. Believe it or not, it's a room below Hogwarts. Why am I not surprised? Shall we? I was hoping you'd say that. Oh, and we'll need to bring the book. How, how big's your inventory? Do they stack, by the way? The room is called the Map Chamber, by <laughs> the way. And the portrait of Percival Rackham awaits us there. Professor Rackham. I look forward to meeting him. How did this Jackdaw get the pages from the book? Evidently, Peeves stole them. And Jackdaw stole them from him. Oh, Peeves. To think it was beneath us all this time. I don't trust this Professor Fig, by the way. I'm thinking like another mad eye moment, you know? Like he's definitely he's definitely doing some tri tricky stuff. Oh, that's not bad. That's actually quite good. Oh, the visuals in this game are just... Seriously. Performance, but even with just performance, it looks Man. fucking amazing. There's Hogsmeade. And over here... The Forbidden Forest. Yeah, I reckon and they'll only do that for course, fidelity. They won't do that for fidelity in ray tracing. It's magnificent. Although I did try it on ray tracing uh, earlier, and Jesus, they've done a good job on it. If only you were here to see this. Hello, Professor Rackham. We've placed the book on the pedestal as you asked. And this is my mentor, Professor Fig. How do you do, Professor Fig? And you, my young friend, see now why you needed to return with the book? I do. I also see why you refer to this room as the map chamber. That you have come this far tells me that you possess extraordinary magical ability, the potential and power of which will unlock 
should you prove yourself worthy. The location of each of four trials will, in time, appear on the map. Trials that will test you and give you access to invaluable knowledge. Trials that you must complete on your own. Do you recall the pensive memory you viewed in my vaulting yeah, gringots? I, <laughs> I was tired. You and your friend Charles spoke of the port key and of trials you'd created for one who could see traces of ancient magic. Precisely. Charles is another of the keepers, a designation we gave ourselves centuries ago, in light of the knowledge that we have been bound to keep hidden. Until, perhaps, now. So, the passage from your ruins to Gringotts, everything in the vault, the restricted section, finding this room, none of these was a trial. They were an important part of the journey, but they were not trials themselves. The fact that you have come this far, however, bodes well. The trials were designed to ensure that the power and knowledge we have kept secret for so long does not fall into the wrong hands. They will test your abilities, both innate and learned. But of equal importance, everything you witness as you complete the trials will inform what you choose to do with all that we share. You will need patience. The trials have much to teach you. It will take time. I'm afraid we don't have the luxury of time. We have waited this long, Professor Fig. Surely a few more. Respectfully, sir, while I do not know the secret you keep, I do know that our young friend here has seen traces. Traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. And we encountered an uncommonly powerful goblin wielding such magic as we prepared to leave your vault at Gringotts. We may already be too late. This is grave news indeed. Young friend, do you trust Professor Fig? I do. Then, in the light of your considerable skill and all you have already accomplished, we shall begin. You will find the location of the first trial marked on the map below you. Whilst Professor Fig may assist you oh, in locating good. the trials, they may be completed Go only by one with our ability. Shall we have a look? I know that tower. It's not far. You may have seen it yourself. I don't think I have. Perhaps your young friend is not as well traveled as you think. As your mentor, the least I can do is go ahead to make sure it is safe. Join me as soon as you can. I'll find you at the tower as soon as I can. Until then, be careful. And do not tell anyone where you're going. Oh, that is so cool. Little 3D map under the floor. I want to go hit wherever this is. There's like a glow here by some sort of cave or something. Where would that be in control? So, Hogwarts is there. Building to the left. Okay, so. Hogwarts. It's going to be down here somewhere.
Jesus, I forgot how big the map was. Four skill sets now. Oh, I, I have. One, I've got like one for like long range stuff, one for like close range. Storybook. Oh, love finding random things like that. I'd be terribly grateful if you could help me and my friend with a time-sensitive delivery. Oh, here's a pleasant surprise. doing needs doing huh. 
love just rocking up in someone's house and stealing all their shit. <coughs> just found a new wand handle. Seems a pleasant enough little place. Be strong, Alexandra. Just the menu music? <laughs> the menu music? Ah, oh, yeah, 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 okay. Like the ambience, ambiance. To be fair, the music is just incredible. <laughs> In this game, they've done a really good job with that. Mm -hmm. In the shadow of the undercroft. Why does that ring a bell? I think that's how you unlock the unforgivable, unforgivable curses. Have you seen the way they do the out of bounds thing? It's quite clever. Done any, any of these yet? These poppy balloon things. Well, all of them. <laughs> uh, why am I not surprised? Line is pretty good as well. Mm hmm. Found some sort of cave. Akio. Levioso. Expelliarmus! Confirm them! Lumos! I did. Incendio.
watch that. Let me know. Let me know. <laughs> I need to find a tube, don't I? Where's the cube? There's gotta be someone. Gotta be around here somewhere. Good thing! Incendio! Levioso! Ugh. Shame you're so foul. Hey, I found the cube. <gasps> Come here. The pulse. Nope. Damn it, wrong spell. Akio. Do I have to? Oh, do I have to like float it? <laughs> oh, that's sick. <laughs> this could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Let's go. Rebellion. Oh! Have you been in here yet? Yeah. I just found like one of these little secret... Secret at where... Look at it, what's this? Say that will happen, it's probably going to be better than the one I've got. It is. Probably will miss it now.
That's so bad. Oh, he's not here anymore. He was here. This guy with the niffler. But you found him now anyway, so... Does the Hogwarts Express ever go past or not? Yeah. I really hope so. Oh, I found the Nifflers. Just out of pure chance. Nice. Alright, I remember this location when I come. Sure, how I'd fare in a little place like this. Uh, atomic heart. That's the one. It's gonna be yeah. sick. Looks awesome. <laughs> and then we got here. Lightfall. Hmm. <laughs> I love how everyone has gone. Hmm. Oh, IGN showed off 20 minutes of Jedi uh, Survivor earlier today. I haven't watched it yet. Yeah, I'm sure I saw it pop up. Like, first preview or something. Nine minutes. Nine minutes. We're not alone. We Who's are that? not. <laughs> Ranrock's loyalists. Around a dozen, I can see, <laughs> but could be more. Can't we operate past them into the tower? We could, but we've no idea what's in the tower. More importantly, however, I'd like to know why they're oh. here. They've set up camp just ahead. I suggest we investigate a little before doing anything else. Let's go. Well, uh. this isn't ideal. No, it isn't. This way. I'll uh, be back in just a sec. I'm going to stop my stream for now, I think. Actually, no, I'm gonna, I might keep it going. No, I'm going to stop the stream. Just, I think I'm done for today. I've been streaming for three hours, 20 minutes. <laughs> uh, can't really do it. I'm streaming straight from Xbox. So I'm streaming through this new Streamlabs console thing, which is on a web browser. That's why I can get like text and stuff off on my screen, which is quite cool. But it's streaming straight from my Xbox.
All I need is a phone, really. I've got my laptop next to it, but, you know. Back in a sec. Thanks for watching, whoever's still there watching, and maybe streaming tomorrow with Twitch drops on, but I'll let you know on the Discord and stuff. Uh, thanks for watching and good night.